Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is x square minus x power of 3 is equal to 36. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, in the first step, we'll take this 36 to the left side. So, it will be this, which is x square minus x power of 3. 36 we take to this side will be minus 36 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, we'll split this negative 36 according to the corresponding exponents of x power of 2 and this x power of 3. So it will be x square minus x power of 3. Then minus 36 is same as minus 9 minus 27. Then is equal to 0. Then in the next step, it will be x square minus x power of 3. Minus 9 is same as minus 9, it is 3 square. Then minus 27, it is 3 power of 3. Then is equal to 0. <coughs> then in the next step, we'll put the like terms of the same power together. So we we'll start by this x power of 2 minus this 3 power of 2. So we we'll write it x power of 2 minus 3 power of 2. Then this minus x power of 3 minus 3 power of 3 with same power of 3. So here minus x power of 3 minus 3 power of 3 is equal to 0. Then in the next step, into here we we'll place this together. So we we'll put this inside the bracket so it will be x power of 2 minus 3 power of 2 inside the bracket. And in here negative is common. So we'll take negative outside of bracket. Negative x power of 3 divided by negative, it is x power of 3. Negative 3 power of 3 divided by negative, it will be plus 3 power of 3. Then bracket is equal to 0. Then in the next step, from this part here, x power of 2 minus 3 power of 2 is in the form of a perfect square. So we'll apply a perfect square rule in this form, which is a power of 2 minus b power of 2 is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. Whereas if this part is in this form, which is equal to this form, we'll apply this form. So it will be a plus b, it is x plus, x plus 3. So here it will be x plus 3 bracket, then times a minus b, it will be x minus 3. So here x minus 3 bracket, then this minus. In this part here, this x power 3 plus 3 power 3, this is in the form of a perfect cube. So we'll apply a perfect cube in this form, whereas this is in the form of a power 3 plus b power 3, which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket. So when we apply this form, it will be a plus b is x plus 3. So here bracket x plus 3 bracket then br times bracket here a square it will be x square so x square then minus a times b a is x b is 3 so x times 3 is 3 x then plus b square it will be this 3 square which is 9 bracket is equal to this 0 then in the next step into this our equation, x plus 3 is common. So we'll take x plus 3 bracket out of bracket. Then this divided by this, it is this x minus 3. Then here minus this divided by this, it is this, this quadratic expression. So here we'll place bracket, this a quadratic expression x square minus 3 x plus 9 bracket then bracket is equal to 0 then into here we'll open this bracket by this negative here so it will be x plus 3 bracket then bracket this 
xc minus 3. Here we open the bracket by negative, it will be minus x square. Minus and minus, it will be positive 3x, then minus 9. Bracket is equal to 0. Then it will be x plus 3, bracket, bracket. Into here, we'll start by this negative, it will be negative x square. Then with x, x plus 3x is 4x, so it will be plus 4x. Then minus 3 minus 9 is minus 12, bracket is equal to 0. Then from here we have two solutions. Well, as this is the first solution, x plus 3 is equal to 0. And this is the second solution, minus x square plus 4x minus 12 is equal to 0. Then from this first solution, we'll take 3 to the right side. So it will be x is equal to negative 3. Therefore, this is the first value of x, which is the real solution. Then to solve from this quadratic equation, we'll solve by using quadratic formula. But into this x square, here we have this negative. So we'll divide the whole equation by negative 1. So negative x square divided by negative 1 is positive x square. Positive 4x divided by negative 1, it will be minus 4x. Minus 12 divided by negative 1, it will be positive 12. Then is equal to 0 divided by negative 1 is 0. Now from here, to find the values of x, we will use quadratic formula. So from quadratic formula, which is x is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a. Then it will be x is equal to negative b, it is this negative 4. So here bracket negative 4 plus or minus square root of b square. It will be this negative 4 bracket square. Then minus 4 times a, a is 1, times c, c is 12. Then over 2 times a, a is 1. Then it will be x is equal to negative and negative to be positive 4 plus or minus square root of negative 4 square, it is 16. Negative 4 times 12, it will be negative 4 times 12 is 48. Then over this times this is 2. Then it will be here, it will be x is equal to 4 then plus or minus square root of this square root of 16 minus 48, it will be minus 2, 3. So it will be minus 32, then over 2. Then it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of negative 32 is same as 32, it is 16 times 2, then times this negative here, negative 1 then over 2 then it will be x is equal to 4 plus or minus square root of 16 is 4 then times this square root of 2 times square root of negative 1 is i so it will be times i then over 2 then to simplify these two cancel by 1 and here by 2 and this by 2 therefore into here we have two solutions so, for this complex solution here, this is the first value of x, which is the real solution. Then the second value of x is equal to, which is the complex solution. So, it will be 2, then plus 2 square root of 2i. This over 1, so it is the same thing. So, it will be 2 plus 2 square root of 2i. So, the second value of x is 2 plus 2 square root of 2i. And the third value of x is equal to, when it is negative here, it will be 2 minus 2 square root of 2i. So here 2 minus 2 square root of 2 times i. So these are all the three values of x in this our problem. Whereas we have one real solution 
and two complex solutions which is this and this now to check if these values are correct we'll check for this real solution of x is equal to negative 3 now let's verify to check for x is equal to negative 3 we'll substitute negative 3 into here x and this x so it will be negative 3 bracket square then minus here it will be negative 3 bracket power of 3 is it equal to this which is 36 then into here negative 3 square it is 9 then minus negative 3 power of 3 is negative 3 times negative 3 times negative 3 which is negative 27 then bracket is equal is it equal to this 36 now to open this bracket here it will be negative or negative it will be positive so it will be 9 plus 27 which is equal to 36 because 9 plus 27 is 36 is equal to 36 now left side and right side are equal then it is true for the value of x is negative 3 as the real solution and also the complex solution the other complex solutions are correct Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.